Hi, I'm Kevin. And I'm Emily Rose. And we have a deep love for The Root. We have traveled a lot as a couple. Especially as musicians and professional pickers. But nothing gets us more excited than America's Mother Road. Join us as we hit all of your favorite spots on the Illinois stretch of Route 66. So buckle up. This This is is Main Street Street of of America. America. So, I think we're off to Litchfield now. Litchfield. What's, uh, what's on the itinerary? Well, Litchfield, I think we're going to the Litchfield Route 66 Museum. Sweet. So that's going to be cool. Yeah, that'll be cool. And one of the things that I'm really excited about, which is the Skyview Drive-In in Litchfield. Oh, you love a drive-in. Oh, I, you love a drive-in. I, we do. We do. I get excited about that one. So I'm, I'm excited about that. Sweet. It's going to be a cool stop. Awesome. Well, hi, nice to meet you. I'm Emily. Hi, Emily. It's a pleasure. I'm Kevin. Hi, I'm Carol. Nice to meet you, Carol. President here of the Litchfield Museum and Route 66 Welcome Center. So, welcome. Thank you. We're glad to be here. Absolutely. We're excited to take a look. Yeah, we've noticed a few amazing things already after coming coming into Litchfield. Yeah. What is this place right across the street? Uh, That's the historic Ariston Cafe. Okay. It's been years since uh, Route 66 opened. Mm-hmm. And uh, in fact, it's the only continuously run restaurant from here to California. No way. So, yeah. Yeah, this place is fun and looks colorful. I even. This is cool. I mean, and I've heard you say before, this is not only just Route 66 history, but also Litchfield yes, history as well. Right. Yeah. And, and Route 66 is a big part of Litchfield yeah. history because it just ran right through it. You know, and back in the day, there were lots of businesses. Yeah, you know, sure. Anything from a restaurant to a car dealership to mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. any kind of business along the way. Yeah. Sure. So Litchfield, you would say, probably is synonymous to a lot of towns along the route. It's become synonymous with the identity of the route. Oh, oh it has been. Yeah. You know, we've had visitors from literally all over the world, and you know, they'll make Litchfield a destination stop. Yeah. Yes. And. Uh, Used to be because of the Ariston or the Skyview Drive-In, mm-hmm. but now our museum is kind of popping up more and more on Good. their Good. vocabulary. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, that's, that's great right to hear because people should be. be yeah, of too. course. Yeah, okay, right here on this wall is all of our uh, the which or the uh, Hall of Fame Route 66 businesses and. One of them is the Skyview Drive-In, oh. mm-hmm. uh, the Ariston Cafe, and New Belts Bakery Cafe. So that's how you say that. I was wondering. <laughs> oh, New Belts. Yeah, it's a German word. Okay. And you know, some people say Jew Belts, but sure. it's, I guess, technically U Belts. Okay. So, yeah. Nice. Wow. That's a great picture of, of yeah. the museum. Yeah. This is what we look like at nighttime. That's oh, just beautiful. glowing. We love a neon on that. Oh, it is, uh, it is she glows beautifully. Is. Look at that. Wow. That's, that's a sight to oh. behold. Right. Because neon is another Route 66 thing. Yes. yes. So. Yeah, and around the corner, we have a, another neon sign. Yeah. Oh, look at the old Indian test pattern. Oh, that's great. I know. Look at your old radios and television. Oh. That is really cool. Oh yeah, look at this sign. Look at this old like big top on her. Wow. I know you love you yeah, love do, circus I stuff. Do. That's awesome. Look at this. Check wow. this out. So cool. So much to look at. Oh my gosh. Can we take this home? It's in great condition too. Oh. Wow, that's beautiful. It's huge. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of fun things to interact with in here. That's very cool. That's really great. That's cool. We have an old TV even at our house, and we have an Indian test pattern. We have the same thing. I put an Indian test pattern in. That's awesome. We have a little light behind it, lets it glow up. Uh We love it. This is another favorite of visitors. This license plate collection belonged to one family. They saved every plate since. They had a car, I think, from 1922, I think it is. That's really neat. What a great personal collection to give up. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I wanted to see this old jukebox right now. Oh. This thing is awesome. That is. Look at this. You don't really see ones like this either. Wow. Yeah, that is unique. It's almost got like a refrigerator quality to right. it. Right. Look at all this like cosmonaut stuff oh, from the 50s. This is so cool. Johnny loves Shelly. Mr. Lonely. She's not 
can't have it without Neil Sedaka in there. No. Elvis. Beach Boys, fun, fun, fun. Why do fools fall in love? Devil in the sky. So this was donated by the Becker family, the Vernon Becker family. That's really cool. That is cool. That's awesome that people in the community are giving up their own things to What's just... cool, because I mean, as much as, history. I know, it's because as much as we want to save stuff ourselves and put it in our basement and no one can see it, it's cool that everyone is now can see this kind of stuff. That's true. I mean, I just, you just wonder how much stuff is in people's basements that could be shown for, to the rest of the public, right? <laughs> Celebrity from oh, yeah. This guy here, Robbie, he's um, Frankie Valley's band. Oh, no way. Well, that's really that's cool. For, oh, gosh, over 30 years. Wow. But he's from Litchfield, and he's a big Litchfield promoter. There's, and there's he Frankie wrote, and, and, and Paul McCartney right there. Yeah, wow. Well, he, really um, he did a version of Get Your Kicks on Route 66. Fine. You need to look it up. It's really okay. great. It's a good version. Because Whenever that one line goes from it goes from Chicago to LA, yeah, they say it goes from Litchfield to LA. Nice, yeah, that's, that's fun. fun. He he's the, he produced that record, Aww. so it's it's on YouTube. You should be able to find it. It's very but, cool. Uh, mm -hmm. And that's that's what he's playing on stage right there. Yeah, that's a well, guitar. Yeah, guitar. You don't see them around much anymore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have you noticed anything uh, lately where it's, uh, the numbers are starting to come up? Or? They are. That's they great. Are. Yes, they are. And last year they started to. Good to hear. Wonderful. Yeah. Thank, you. Thank you. And we appreciate you. We'll be yes, stopping in again. Yeah, There's more to look at. I know. I know. You better hurry and get out of here. I know. <laughs> we got to go see the Skyview drive in. Yeah, we do. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks again, Carol. Thanks. Wow. Wow. Yeah, we barely scraped the surface. There's so much. So much in yeah. there. It's incredible. It's been on a whole day just in there. I know, no kidding. Yeah. Um, Where do you want to try yeah, the... Maybe check out that Aristotle Let's Cafe. do it. Right I just want to see it. Yeah, let's... Wow. Cafe. Get your kicks on the roof. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to... I know, right? Wow. Oh, my gosh. They still have all the pools. I haven't seen something like this since I was a little kid. Yeah. Oh. I can't this believe. This is amazing. They Look still have the pools. Look at this. They still have the speaker pools. Oh my no. I'm so glad they didn't rip these out. Even though we're we're tuning in on the radio right. now, the fact that they still have the poles, it's just so nostalgic. That's really cool. It's so awesome. My gosh, this place just radiates light. It's just such a like, oh my god. Yeah, I'd love it. Oh. You know, I remember when I was a kid, we would go to the drive-in theater back when it was there's the one in St. Louis was still open. Mm -hmm. uh, it was called the, the 66 Drive-In. It was on Route 66. And you would go to the bathroom or go to get something to eat while the movie was starting. And you'd hear all the radios going on all at once. And it just sounded like a thousand CB radios oh on and the movies playing. And it just had this amazing sound. Such an atmosphere. Oh. Un unmatched. Wow. I'm sure that this is incredible at night. Can oh, you imagine yeah. the stars? The I mean, stars, no wonder sky this. views. Yeah. The stars at night. I love the old gravel yeah. pit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The gravel pit is awesome. And they give you a little lawn area. That's so sweet. And it's actually a big one. I know. I've been to some where they're, they don't go back that far. Mm hmm. That's really deep. Really cool. Man, it just screams. Summer. The 50s, summer, 1960s era. I know. I feel like I can hear doo-wop music I and I smell like burgers and... <laughs> and... Funnel cakes and burgers. <laughs> and, and, and let's go out to the movies. Let's go out to the movies. Let's go out to the movies. To get us to the tree. Love it. Love it. Well, I'm so glad we stepped into this. There's just... Uh, I just want to have this place all to ourselves. What we do, we do. We, we want to camp here. Right? Yeah. Ourselves. These are awesome. <laughs> well, I think this is amazing. Yeah. yeah. The next spot. Let's do it. Yeah. This has been really cool. Litchfield, awesome stop. Yeah. Litchfield. Visit Litchfield. <laughs> Litchfield is a great 66 town. All right, let's go to the next one. On to the next one.